Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I have an exciting video to share with you guys. If you guys remember, I told you guys that I reorganized my planner and craft area, which is located in my dining room. I have a pretty big dining room, so I kind of took it over, and this is where I craft and plan, and this is also where I work from home. So I did rearrange my furniture. I absolutely love how it turned out. I feel like it's a lot more functional. It works a lot better. I also moved some things around in terms of storage and where they used to be places that it makes a little bit more sense um i do want to um, add some new pieces as far as like furniture goes i'm thinking possibly a new desk um and then some other um storage pieces of furniture but you know i'm still kind of shopping around i want to make sure that the pieces that i buy are going to be the correct pieces for me because i want to have them for a good long while so um yeah but you know if i ever get to finish that i don't know if it'll be the end of this year or not but i'll definitely share the video with you guys um but i'm really excited um let's go ahead and get started because this is going to be a pretty long video so grab whatever you need to grab to keep you um watching whether it's coffee or your snacks your hot cheetos uh your planner your craft stuff whatever it is you want to do if you want to organize while you're watching this to get some inspiration by all means go ahead and do it and yes so let's go ahead and start over in this space i'm going to give you guys a quick overview first of everything and then we'll kind of go into the details so this is what my working station looks like that's my computers and then um that space right there it was not there i used to have like a bookshelf there with all of my stickers and so now i added those pieces there over on this side um i actually do have some new pieces that um you guys haven't seen you probably only seen them on instagram but i have two um, of those drawers from michael's with the two cubbies i love them you guys so far they work really great these pieces right here stay the same um the only difference is that i moved this cart over here it used to be all the way at the far end over there um i rearranged some of the decorative pieces and whatnot some of these drawers and bins um weren't here before either um over here on this side this is my alex drawer it used to be with my desk so now i moved it over here and i actually like it a lot better because now i have a place for my hot glue gun um keeping my hot glue gun is one of the difficulties that i used to have because i like to have it on display because i'm always using it so i wanted to make sure you know that i had a good spot for it so i think it's perfect where it is right now and look at my hatsune miku i love her i got her um at the anime convention this year she's the cutest thing ever um and then over here on this part this is new you guys will see the bookshelf used to be behind me where my computer desk is now it's over here this piece used to be turned to the wall this way and now i flipped it and now it's over here this is kind of like my bts um station along with like my cricket and some other fun things and then as you can see um I also moved my pom-pom trim. It used to be in that little three-piece cubby thing from Ikea right there, but they are no longer there. Now they are housed there, and I actually like them there. Um, they look really cute. Um, I cleaned the top of that shelf so that it can be functional. Um, I hold some pieces up there. And then this is my wall with my pegboards. I am thinking of either getting one more pegboard or maybe some like little shelves. Um, or I might get just another shelf to go here. I don't know yet. I really can't take up a lot of space because I do need room to be able to pull out my baskets. Um, but right now I like it because I have my... Um, uh, Michael's cart there and it holds all of my stickers it is over overloaded you guys I need a sticker storage solution like pretty bad <laughs> um, so I like it because my stickers are here and then my stickers are all over here as well um, I think that's pretty much the only spot where I have stickers aside from like my little sticker books um, so I have my cute little decorative wall right there, which we'll get into. I have my ironing board there and then my boards for when I take pictures and for when I'm hot gluing and that sort of thing. Um, 
Don't mind her. She's pee pad. I just cleaned it. He's trained. He's always been trained to pee on his pee pads because um, I used to work in an office and I used to work really, really long hours. But after COVID, I transitioned to working from home. And now he's just so used to being, you know, trained and peeing on his pee pad. Um, I do try to take him out as much as I can now that I'm home. But, you know, it kind of just stays like that. Um, so this area right here, I rearranged. Um, my cubby used to be over on that side. These little um, uh, closet made shelves used to be over on this side. Now I have a spot for my sewing machine that works a lot better. That little cart I used to have in my kitchen, I took it out and I put it there and it works great for my sewing machine. Another issue that I had as far as like uh, where to store it. I rearranged my Ikea pegboard because when we bought my daughter's pegboard, she wanted one for her college dorm. We went, so I bought more shelves and little storage pieces for mine. So I love it. And we'll go that, we'll, you know, we'll look at it in detail. I was also able to move some of the drawers that I had in my cubby so that it houses my planners and my pens um, because I need a good spot to display them. And then over here, this rack used to hold my um, 12 by 12 paper pieces and now they hold some storage. I'm still thinking like what I'm going to do with my 12 by 12s. I might move those bins. I don't know yet, but you know, for now they work there. My BTS poster, I kind of just put it there for a filler space right now. I love it. <laughs> um, this little thing right here, I love it. Um, technically, it should be um, hanging on the wall, but I need to find some nice, dirty nails. So whenever I get the chance to do that, um, I will go to Home Depot and get some nice, dirty nails because I do want to hang it on the wall. And then there's actually some other wall pieces that I want to hang up as well. Um, and then over here on this side, I just have my little cubby station. So yeah, we can start actually actually over here and then we'll just kind of work our way around um so at the very top you guys will see that i just have some decorative pieces sorry for the shadow i have my little um crafty delicious cpc um or my shine sticker studio chicago planner conference postcard i framed it i have some fun decorative pieces this was a fun gift um over here i have my memory dex rollers this is actually i just crafted yesterday i was behind on my memory dex card so i did the month of august and then this is the month of july and then this is the month of june which is my favorite i love it it looks so cute i have my flamingo pen back there and then yasmin i didn't notice she put her high school diploma so i just kind of displayed it nicely there um over here and here it's pretty much the same thing i'm trying to figure out a washi tape solution um but over here i keep all of my prettiest washi tape um inside this shelf um, because they either still have their little store storage or as you can see these have been sent to me and they're pretty brand new and then I have my little ice cream with some washi storage in there so this is all mostly store um washi over here um they have some gems and then some straws over here um and then over here i got these little candy containers from the dollar tree they're in the party section and they fit so nicely here they're a transparent pink color and they have all of my loose washi tape so i love it i'm thinking of probably doing five more down here and just adding more washi tape they do fit so just in case you guys are wondering and they would all be matching so i kind of like that idea so i'm debating um if that's how i want to use the space um and if i do then i'm gonna have to go to dollar tree and then oh my god my shelf fell i didn't even notice probably when we moved it um i'm gonna have to go in here and fix it but up here this hasn't changed um i have a lot of storage boxes with like uh Sequin mixes, uh, paper clips, loose washi tape, paper clips back there. And then this is all of my Christmas stuff, some extra glue sticks, my Mod Podge. Oh my god, I really gotta fix this. And then down here I have my washi tape drawer, my Valentine's Day washi tape. This is just a little um, extra glass jar that I had, some paper clips, and then in here paper clips, key rings, and all that sort of thing. So. I really have to fix that um, over here I just have all of my beautiful planner bags hanging um, and then 
like I said, my BTS poster. Over here, I just have some things that I need to find storage for. This is a notepad, a sticker book, my Arteza uh, markers, my Teza markers, and my Chocola markers for my chalkboard. And then <laughs> Yasmin's list pad for her college checklist. Over here, I have these little pink uh, bins from Marshalls, or actually Home Goods. This one has um, adhesive felt. This one is empty, which is great because I can, you know, I have room to grow. And then this one has my, um, all my cut up um, uh, faux leather or, um, uh, what do you call it felt pieces so just extra if I you know ever need extra little pieces then they're right here this bin has all of my planner society stuff um, literally all of my planner society supplies is in here I was able to condense and fix it and then I have all of my cute little um, badges from the Chicago planner conference over here on this side, I have my IKEA pegboard. I have this little drawer, which I reorganized. I have my sunlit lamp. I love it. It works great. It has three different settings. And this thing, little it opens up, so you can adjust it however you want. You can put your phone. Super cute. Um, so over here, this hasn't changed. I have my pearls, my pastel pearls, and then all my white pearls. Over here, I have my popsicle sticks for any projects and then I have my little foam uh, paint brushes there and then my little tools these are my most used tools like my punches my um, bone folders and that sort of thing over here I have my trays for when I'm die cutting and then I bought this little set of three containers from Ikea this one's empty so I have room to grow I have my happy planner rings and then my Dollar Tree rings for like flip books and that sort of thing over here I have all my prettiest ribbon in here I used to have a llama wall back there with all my llama stuff so I kind of turned this into my llama station so this has all of my llama stickers notebooks um, that sort of thing llama paper clips again llama paper clips along with my business cards and then I have all of my prettier pens and all of my um, pretty highlighters that um, Cynthia has sent me so I have all of my cute stuff here in this bag I have sorry Hershey in this bag right here I have all of my um, uh, what do you call it electrical wires for my Cricut I forgot the what it's called but um, this llama bag is so cute I love it so I keep all of my wired stuff for my Cricut in here and then in here I have all of my little wires and extra label roller for my faux memo printer which is right here my extra um, faux memo printing paper and then all of my prettiest um, ribbon over here displayed and then here I have all of my cute stationery that are llamas and pineapples because I love llamas and I love pineapples so that's kind of what that looks like I love it, you guys super obsessed um, over here on this side I have all of my pretty planners displayed back there these are all like the larger ones A5s that sort of thing I have my Washington DC mug that houses my pens over here I have more of Traveler's Notebooks, pocket size, standard size, and then my flawless cup holder for my pens. These are my novelty pens. And then over here I have some of the planners that I've recently decorated and or made. And then my Como Se Llama um, coffee mug, which I love, and it houses all of my Planner Society pens. In here, um, this is all sticky notes, and then it also has my um, tablecloth for when I film my video and my extra extension cord. I have all of my yarn, extra pom-pom that I need to put into my pom-pom um, station and then over here I have sticky notes it is filled with all kinds of sticky notes um, this is filled with extra planners that I'm not sure what to do with um, I've already either used them in some way um, there's notebooks that I've used in there for work that I need to find sorry a spot for them and then these are all miscellaneous little gifts that I can use for happy mail or just pieces to decorate any um, project 
And then these are all extra planner supplies, um, whether it's binders, papers, uh, filler, paper, extra covers, that sort of thing. Over here, I have my Singer sewing machine, my washi tape display box, and then over here, I put all of my beautiful pom-pom pens. And then it fits perfectly right here. These bins are from Dollar Tree. I love how they fit perfectly. So in here, I have um, some extra ribbon that I need to put in my ribbon box, and then it houses mostly um, sequin mixes. And here's all my 6x6 six six paper pads. Um, and this one, it's all the projects or little projects that I've done. And then over here, this is all of my shipping supplies, like um, extra tissue paper, extra envelopes, um, little cellophane bags, that sort of thing. So then moving over to this side, I just have my computer station, which is mostly my work from home station. Um, I have my MP3 or my Bluetooth because I love listening to music. I have my headset for when I'm on Zoom meetings and then my, you know, my Alexa, which I'm not going to say loud. Oh, there she goes turning on. It's 526 p.m. Hope you've had a good Wednesday. <laughs> Alexa, turn off. Okay. <laughs> All right. And then we have my girl boss um, sign that Cynthia gave me. I love it. Um, I have my little tray. That's a decorative tray that I got as a gift. It just has some of my important things. And then um, my coffee uh, coaster, my stapler. In here, I have some metal dies, um, some extra pens, my cell phone holder, my lotion and my Vaseline, my notebook for work, my pen that I'm currently using for work, and then that's pretty much what I have there. So my cushion, because I need to be comfortable when I'm working. Um, this drawer pretty much houses, it hasn't really changed, I just kind of reorganized it and moved some things around. Um, over here I have some inks, I have stuff for shakers, these are all glitters. These are all like little sequin mixes that I can use for shakers. I have all of my um, pa paints. Um, they're mostly by Craftsmart. That's the brand that I like to use. Um, again, some inks and stamps and that sort of thing. And I have a lot of stamps right here. Um, so that's pretty much what I have in this drawer. Over here, I have all of my tools and um, boxes. This is the box for my phone memo printer, but it holds some wires in here. My um, my Galaxy earbuds, um, my screwdriver, just some extra tools in here, um, nothing special. Over here, I have all of my tools, um, whether it's paper trimmers, my label maker, my We Are Memory Keeper punch boards, extra glue guns, paper punchers, all of my little punches. All my tools are in this little area. And then over here, I love how my wall looks. It's so cute. I love how like well spaced out it is, how nice and even it looks. So if you guys remember, Cynthia made this for me. She painted it, hand painted it. It says Planning with Ellie and it's Belle because I love Belle from Beauty and the Beast. So I hung her there. And then I have my gorgeous all year round picture frame. And then my favorite quote that's um, inspirational, stop waiting to do things you want to do. So I love that. Over here on this side, just to give you a quick overview. Um, so I have my tripod here. And then I moved my 12 by 12 paper pads here. So I have some on this side, some on this side. And then I have room to grow in the middle. I have my printer in here. I have all of my pencil bags. Um, pencil bags, pencil pouches, passport pouches, um, little extra bags that sort of thing i love this little container um and then over here as you guys can see i have room to grow i want to see if i can find more of these little boxes from the dollar tree um but we'll see i have my little office tool bag and then my little dollar tree dollar tree drawers that hold some essentials um these used to be with my cubby now they're over on this side um but i kind of have a plan for this space so 
this might change up a little bit but for now it works I just have extra cardstock paper in these two and then over here I have important paper for um, YouTube and then this one's empty this one has more adhesive felt that I could transfer over to the other one and then over here I have printing paper which I need to refill this little basket I used to watch my niece and so over here I have all her like little toys to keep her entertained she likes to play with all my little lip glosses that Cynthia gave me I bought her some um, crayons and then all her little like mini toys and a coloring book so she can keep herself entertained um, in here I just have my current pens and markers that I'm using I have displayed some planners um, my crystal that my boyfriend's cousin's wife gave me I love it I feel like it gives me good energy and then um, I have some more planners over here I have my little Dollar Tree containers these are the little macaroon containers I'm sure a lot of planner girls have them because um, they went kind of wild for them over here I have some more washi storage these are all mostly the planner society and then I have some more decorative pieces over here up top I have my little paper clips storage system this is from my goals and it works great for all my paper clips these little drawers are from the Target Dollar Spot and they house my um, die cuts, all my metal dies, or at least the smaller ones that fit in there, and then my little cactus pen holder with all my novelty pens. I have an empty wire basket there and then a wire basket here with my plushies. <laughs> And then over here I have my shelf um, that houses some of my cuter purses. Um, the first four purses are from the Planner Society and then my coach bag is right here. And then the rest of my um, coach bags and my Michael Kors bag is in my bedroom. I have another <laughs> plushie right there and then my Princess Belle globe right there. Over here I have this little basket. Hershey. Over here I have this little basket um, with Carpe Diem stickers and then uh, Agenda 52 and the LOL. These are some of my favorite stickers. And then over here I just have some tassel keychains that I've made. A Valentine's keychain that I made and then um, a tassel keychain that was sent to me as a gift. My um, Falala -la Llama uh, picture frame and then my little house of washies and these are all of some of my cuter displayed washies over here on this side don't mind the heater i'm just going to turn this over this is probably the most organized thing <laughs> i have um this is my cart of notebooks all of these are pocket sized notebooks that i can use for tns some of these are notebooks that i could use for b6 size tns um and then little spiral notebooks that I could use for work and note taking um, standard size TN type of notebooks and then all these are journal notebooks and they're all empty they're all brand new so I can use them um, you know whenever I need them over here I have my box um, for my uh, for what do you call it my fabric uh, to store all of my fabric as you can see I don't have a big collection yet but it's good because then I have room to grow and then over here I have all of my pretty pens that I use for when I make my traveler's notebooks and I put them in my traveler's notebooks as gifts and then over here I have extra scrapbook paper I always tell you guys not to throw away your scrapbook paper um, I definitely go in here a lot um, when I want to make a little card or a little embellishment or something because I try to use this paper up as much as I can I have my mats my Cricut mat is right there um, these are my new um, Halloween collections this is some mail that I got from Amazon that I have to share with you guys my planner um, I was working on it today some mail and that's pretty much what I have here over here I have my little um, three-tier basket um, it houses all of my yarn or at least the yarn that I use the most for my travelers notebooks I love this brand uh, from Hobby Lobby it's the I love this cotton brand works really great and then you know here's 
what I have. This cart right here houses mostly all my holiday stuff, whether it's stickers, um, paper, uh, embellishments, pom-pom trim, you name it. Um, the bottom two are Christmas. I had to put the bottom two at the bottom because they're starting to get pretty heavy and one of my, it's starting to break one of my um, shelves. So um, also what I did was I condensed it and I went through because there was a lot of an extra packaging that I didn't need and just things that I didn't need. So I just needed to um, empty it out a little bit. This one's Valentine's Day. This one's Easter. These two are Halloween. And then this one is other holidays. Over here at the top, I love these two cubbies from Michael's. I'm thinking of getting two more because I feel like my paper pads will probably fit nicely in here. So I think I might do two more or maybe even one more drawer and then do three or a set of six. So I'm not really sure yet. I'm still kind of thinking about it depending what I find. But over here I have both of my laminators. In here I have my, um, this I need for my llama. And then um, I have my Craspire um, sealing wax gift set that was sent to me. I got to find a space for it. I have an extra um, tumbler because I want to make myself one for my coffee. And then this is an extra mat from the Dollar Tree. But in here, this is all mostly for sewing. Well, this is for sewing. This little ruler right here is for sewing. But this houses all of my faux leather material. So um, I love this basket because it's the perfect size to keep my faux leather in here. And my fold leather I use mostly for like bows and that sort of thing. But let me go ahead and put this back in here. Because then otherwise I'll probably just end up leaving it. <laughs> and it fits perfectly in there, that little basket over here. I have my Sizzix machine, my trash bin, which I love now that I have a space to put on it. I always kept it like in a little corner, but now... Um, I can keep it next to my Sizzix machine so that when I'm die cutting, I can just throw all the excess garbage in here. I have this little um, cake stand that, you know, holds my little Hatsune Miku. Um, over here, I have this little shelf that holds my charms with my initial E. It was a gift to me. My little No Problema magnet. This is a candle stand that holds my pineapple or my glass pineapple. This is just a little extra bin for little extra things. Um, this, uh, I try to use it for projects um, that are small enough. I can put each project in here and whatever stuff I'm using for that little project. So if it's a small project, if it's a small TN, then I can, you know, fit it in here. And then my laminating paper. And then these are important papers for my daughter. And then, of course, my glue gun. And then my glass um, cutting mat or board whatever um over here the little pink bins from dollar tree came in handy um i have two of the larger ones here this one holds my scissors and my Sizzix tool and then this one holds all of my adhesives um my glues and then over here i have all of my little um uh, my crap dial and my button setter um i forgot what you call it but yeah, anyways, it's to make it's to do my buttons, my extra key rings for keychains, and then extra eyelets. Over here, I have some more of those pink bins from the Dollar Tree. These two large ones, this one holds my um, larger glue sticks. And then these are some current nail polishes and stuff that I'm using for my, you know, for my nails. Over here, I have little extra of these um, cutters for my uh, tools washi cart this is for my crickets extra erasers and my lighters and then in here this one hasn't changed but i did condense it i emptied um these bins so now i have room you know to use some things i have faux flowers in this one and then in the bottom one i have uh paper clips and then this is um this is, uh, what do you call it, wallpaper? Um, but yeah. 
over here just my um, ironing board and then again these are all of my stickers so these are all mostly like Dollar Tree stickers um, uh, what do you call it um, loose chipboard stickers um, die cuts um, that I can use for decor that's pretty much what all of this is and they're all different sizes big ones small ones large ones over here on this side um this bin has some extra um keychains that i need to find a spot to put and then over here um i think that's the same thing some extra keychains that i have to find a spot to put some of my cute stickers displayed of course rm he's my bias and then some of my prettier keychains if you guys remember i made this little TN mini TN keychain which I love um, and then these are new keychains that I got at the anime convention and then this is my concha <laughs> that I got at the taco festival and I love it and then um, one of my co-workers gave me that j-hope toothbrush at the top um, this Mickey Mouse holds um, just a few little tools this is my happy place um, sign from Michaels. All of my pom-pom trim. I do have more bins in the back. So if I needed, you know, one more row, I have some room to grow there. My llamas. Uh, this is the one I bought in Peru. This is the one that was gifted to me. These are all sticker books. And then my um, Samsung um, uh, iPad holder. And then... Over here, these are all of my Happy Planner sticker books. So these are all Happy Planner. These are all Happy Planner. Over here, these are all of my recollections and other mini sticker books. And then these are some more mini sticker books. Um, they're all pretty much um, by size. So these are like medium, smaller, and then these are smaller. And then over here, I have all of my Etsy type of stickers. These are all of my enamel dots. And then those are my bigger die cuts, or metal dies, should I say. In here, um, I definitely decluttered this. This had a lot of things. Um, so this has um, planners and stuff like that. I have extra bins that I need to figure out what to do or where I could put them. These are all of the letters that you guys have sent to me or the cards that you've sent me in Happy Mail. Or for the holidays, um, I have extra planners over here. Um, I have sticker binder books right there, some larger binders. Um, and here I have all of my envelopes for cards. Um, my sewing bag that has all of my sewing tools. This little box holds all of my Valentine's Day stuff. Um, stickers and die cuts these are my nail polishes from nail reserve i like to keep them in my planner area and then this is the uv light that i bought um for my nail polishes so i got it from amazon i keep it there my arteza glitters is back there this is an extra label maker and then this right here is um, my extra ribbon and some holiday ribbon so that's what i have there um i forgot how i had this oh there we go okay all right and then moving up over here i have a little box where i keep all of my receipts for the end of the year for tax purposes, I have some little empty jars and some little empty bins that I can use for storage and whatever I need. And then over here, I have all of my little micro notebooks and my little mini composition notebooks. Um, we went to a, wedding, to a wedding recently and they gave these out and they're so cute. I just, I love to display them. My little star, here's a little, um, washi gift set that I got from the Chicago Planner Conference. I like to display it. My llama, I bought this one at the Peruvian Festival here in Chicago. We went this summer. And then my planner uh, that houses all of my day covers. 
And these are all sticker books. Sticker books and washi books. And then over here, I have all of my BTS. <laughs> coffee um, I drink them and I love them I wash them and now I just keep them there these are from uni uni the cup sleeves um, this is my bag where my where I bought my um, BTS perfume this is a BTS poster that I have that I want to frame some more um, here's a Koya right here this is a coffee mug from RM and then this is Koya, who's our also RM. Um, my BTS permission to dance button, my BTS banner, my BTS Polaroid, my Suzo. My daughter has a bigger collection of like the DVDs and stuff, but I really wanted the Suzo, so I bought it. My gin, this is RM's cologne, and it smells so good. Um, a picture of my daughter in Hershey, and then this little box is where RM's cologne came in, and it has pictures. Um, but yeah, this is my baby Koyas, and I love them. This is my vaccinated BT21 pin, my Koya pin, and then my permission to dance pin. And then over here, I just have some fun, cute little pictures. Um, this is when we went to the anime convention. It's with our family. Um, some cute little things. That's Hershey Boy right there. Um, some cards that I have displayed. This is the wedding that we went to recently. Um, we had some little Polaroid pictures. That's me and Willie. Me, Willie, and his friend. And then over here I just have my essential oils and then some florals. And then my Cricut. And that's pretty much what that space looks like. But yeah, I think I pretty much went through everything. Oh, in here, I forgot to go through these. Um, over here, I have all of my foam stickers and some adhesive stickers. It's so nice and organized. Over here, I have my elastic bands um, for my traveler snow books. Over here I have all of my adhesive pockets and some extra label sheets. And then over here I have all of my Dollar Tree washi. Look at how beautiful this drawer is. And I have room to grow. And then over here I have my Cricut um, vinyl. And this one I have all of my charms and my tools for my charms. I love how organized it is. I have my ribbon, some more ribbon back here, and then another drawer of ribbon, <laughs> and then I have some mail that I have to find somewhere to sort, and then some stuff that I have to sort, but otherwise I have two extra drawers. But um, yeah, I think that's pretty much it. I think I pretty much went through everything. If you guys have questions about anything, just let me know in the comments down below. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, I tried to be as still as possible. I tried to explain everything as best as I could. Again, if you guys have any questions, just leave it in the comments down below. Thank you guys for hanging out with me and watching today's video. Don't forget to subscribe, give it a thumbs up, and I'll see you guys on the next one. Bye!